Jessica Lapigard is still dealing with the loss of her grandmother, Dolores McDonald. Oh, my grandma. She was um, pretty amazing. She was strong, smart. Dolores was a resident at the Sanford Hospice Centennial Cottage in January of 2024. My grandma's stay was about a week. She battled colon cancer for much of her life. It's still hard for Lapigard and her family, but she said she couldn't have asked for better care for her grandma. We 100% felt like we were part of a family here and we were allowed and accepted to do as we chose for however long we wanted to be with my grandma. Dolores actually trained Dana Paint Award, the LPN who cared for Dolores while she was in hospice. When I walked into work that day, I saw her name up on our census board and I just thought, I know that name. And so then when I went into the room, of course, everything came back. Lapigard is now a social worker at the exact place her grandmother stayed. She's gotten to see the level of care and attention residents receive from providers, both as a family member to a patient and now as a provider. We all want what's best for our patients and we want them all to feel cared for and loved until their last days. I'm a hugger <laughs> and I get very close to my patients. In Sioux Falls, Simon Floss, Sanford Health News.